Hi my beautiful friends this is Dolly Jain and today the drape that I'm sharing with you is a two piece sari very well known as Mekla Chadar I love the way they traditionally wear the sari but we all know that we want some change so I'm going to share the uh, you know the traditional way as well as the modern way a little twist that I've given to this traditional uh, fabric so I hope you all will like it so let's get started so this is how it is this thing comes like this it is stitched okay it's like you know if you can see i just got into it so this is stitched now where you should start your pleat i mean i've seen a lot of videos they say you can just start your pleats from anywhere but you have to be very careful try and start your pleat where you have this joint because this will help you get that perfect pleat in you know your first pleat in place so i'm going to show you see this so what i'm going to do is I made my first pleat using this and the second pleat like this, okay? And with the help of your hand, you can just do this and see you get your pleats like this. So you won't get more than two pleats, uh, I don't think so. I mean, if girls are uh, quite slim there, so three pleats maximum. And if you think you're not getting the second pleat, you don't have to get disappointed. What you have to do is take this, I mean, the first pleat where we started from, and make a big pleat like this see so you can either make two pleats or make one big pleat and fix it to it okay so after i've done this i would like to make two pleats so i'm going ahead with two pleat thing and this is how you do and first don't tuck anything from behind you do this and you tuck the first thing here okay this and then you tuck the rest After you've done this pleat, I mean I've made two pleats, after you've done this, then what you do? Take this dupatta, the chodar, and see what we do. First, roughly place it on your shoulders, bring this down here, and remember, this part, I mean this part of the border, has to be in front like this, okay? Then you attach a pin. So before you attach a pin, what you do is just take this and make a zigzag. See what I'm doing? I'm making a zigzag and I'm just going to tuck this part inside and pin. See what I've done? I made it zigzag and I've pinned this. Now you have to also pin this part, otherwise it will keep a flaring from here okay so what I do is I take another pin press this down nicely take a nice small small uh, you know uh, golden pin and you can just attach a pin here inside so you know nobody can see it but it's still there look at this right like this and for this part if you want you can pleat it like this and put it on your shoulders or if you want you can also leave it open now as i told you all that i'm going to show you a modern way to do it this is the traditional style okay i'm going to show you a modern way to do it now this remains the same the change that we're doing is here so you take out the pin from here and what you do is take this part and guys if you see me looking here and there i've just kept a mirror so that I can see myself and see that I'm co uh, correctly doing the trick. So just this goes inside here and I'm going to attach a pin. You can also put this pin from outside, it's not visible but I would prefer it from within so that uh, you know it's safe and uh, secure there. So it's like this and if you want you can take a double make a broader pleat and wear it like this it looks this is how it looks from here and if you want you can also make narrow pleats but I like it open I like it like this like this so I'm also going to show you another one a drape in this so let me share that with you okay now for the third drape what I've done is I've just taken the palla pinned it on the shoulder and one behind and as you all know I love 
uh, you know, blending drapes of two states. So this is the Rajasthani thing. And this is an Assam fabric. So you know, a blend of Rajasthan and Assam. I think it looks very beautiful. I hope it looks beautiful and you all also like it. So this is how it is. And what I do is I make, I take this palla, make a little zigzag from here. And I hold this here like this. So I hope you all liked it. What you can do is, the only thing that you have to be careful about is this part and this part should be balanced. I mean, see, like this. This should not be low. So you just have to be careful about that. And that's it. So I hope you liked it. And also, you know, you can pin this part here. So the moment you pin, you know, your hands are easy. You can work, you can do anything. It's not that you have this fabric in your hand, so it's restricted. Nothing like that. And also when you're wearing something like that, when you're so dressed up, you just want to stand and do nothing and, you know, just enjoy the whole festive season of yours. So guys, I hope you like this trip and please do comment. Don't forget to share because, you know, when you share, we spread this beautiful Indian art of tripping globally. I hope you all are enjoying all my trips. Keep loving me. I love you all. Jai Hind. Thank you.